arcade heroes. Greetings, what you see here happened to be a line that was for the most popular game of Pinball Expo 2024, and that would be Alice's Adventures in Wonderland by Dutch Pinball. And Dutch Pinball may not be a name that you know because they haven't done a whole lot. Uh, they did uh, Big Lebowski Pinball, and I think there was one other sort of kit for pinball related thing, but not like a full pinball machine on that one, but uh, this one that they brought out to Pinball Expo 2024 in Chicago was uh, quite an impressive looking game, although I was not expecting it to be um, grown up Alice in Wonderland, I guess is the nice way to put it. I was expecting something maybe a little more Disney, but uh, all the little details that they put into this machine looked really good and the layout looked like it was fun and judging by how from the moment Pinball Expo opened to when I left there was always a line I mean, even late into the night it was just packed and I know there were some people that went and played it again now of course the reason why this uh, would have such a line to it is because this is going to be a rare game. They said that only 500 of them would be produced, and then it was something like $13,000. So with that in mind, the chances of finding this on location are pretty slim. But again, I didn't hear anything negative about it, and it just looks like a very beautiful game. My guess is the only thing I would complain about for the price is that uh, I prefer to have wireframe ramps as opposed to the plastic ones. It's, that would look nicer. But it has a second story up there uh, on the upper right hand, or smaller upper play field. This is the correct way to put it. And those LED effects on the blades on the side are really cool. Let's see probably saw there earlier but unfortunately because of the lines and because of how busy I was I was unable to play this one so I can't comment myself on how it plays and I guess I missed out on my opportunity I'd hoped to get to the expo early enough or uh, stay late enough to have been able to go and check it out but I just I got too tired and uh, as far as staying late goes and then I had too many things to go and do and I still didn't get to do everything that I wanted to do. But again, if I was um, not wanting for cash right now, which I have been, uh, and wanted something unique for my location, I would definitely grab this. If money were no object and I was a collector, then I'd uh, go for it too, but otherwise under normal circumstances a game like this as beautiful as it is it's just too pricey but thanks for watching we'll catch you on the next video